Hello guys and welcome to Python Programming Tutorials by Amul's Academy. And today in this tutorial we are discussing about a patent program. So we already discussed many patent program in this video series. And this video contains all those star patterns which we discussed previously in this video series. So that if you want to learn about the pattern program, you can learn it by watching single video. So today we are printing characters in different shape. First we are printing in the square shape. Next in the triangle shape. Triangle we can draw in different ways, right? Like this. Like this. Like this. We can draw diamond shape, right? We can do many things. We can draw this. We can print different characters in these shapes. So I am including all these shapes and few other shapes also. So this is the program to print this symbol in the square shape. So here I am using two for loops, nested for loops. And we are taking the input from the user. We are asking the user to enter the number of rows. And we are storing it in this variable. And we are printing this in the num rows and num columns. So now if I save this and run this. So if I enter seven, it will print seven rows and seven columns. Okay. We can do it in another way also without using the nested for loop. That is we can use the concatenation symbol and multiplication symbol. So here I can take print in that I can take, I want to print the symbol this how many times num times. Okay. So if I save this and run this, Here we can see for zero row it will print this symbol num times for first row it will print this symbol num times okay like this if you want space between this here you can give that if I take seven it will print seven rows and seven columns okay so if you want you can change the characters if you write star here it will print star okay so we get to know how to print star or any character in the square shape. So we are done with this. Next we'll move on to this triangle shape. Okay. So first we'll begin with this right triangle shape. I want to print the star now in the right triangle shape. So for that what I need to do is I need to mention here I. That is nothing but I need to mention how many stars I want in each row. When I is zero I want one star right. So here multiply i, i value is 0 first. So it will print 0 star. Okay, it won't work. So for that I can take range as like this 1 to num plus 1. Or I can take range as 0 to num but here I need to take i plus 1. In the first row I want 1 star. In the second row I want 2 star. I want i star in each row. Okay, so if I save this and run this. Here we go. So this is the first row. It contains 1 star. This is the second row. It contains 2 star. Okay, so that's why here we mentioned multiply i and here I took range as 1 to num plus 1 because if I take 0 to num, 0 into star, so it will become 0. So it won't print any star in the first row. I don't want that. I want 1 star in the first row. That's why here I took range as 1 to num plus 1. If you don't want to change the range, if you want to keep that same, that is 0 to num, then here you need to mention i plus 1. So we are done with the right triangle shape also. So next we'll draw this shape. Okay. So for this here we can see this contains space here. First we need to print space. Next here we print star. Okay. So that is nothing but here I need to include space also. First I need to print space. Next followed by the star. So here I'll mention space multiply how many times. I'll mention num minus i times. That is the formula. Okay, so this is the formula to print the space. Okay, when number of row is 4, pattern will be like this. So in the first row, we want 3 space. So that is nothing but num minus i. Num is 4, i is 1 because here range will be start from 1. So 4 minus 1, it will print 3 space. Okay, it will work. That's why I took the formula like this. So here, this is the concatenation symbol. So first we want to print this space. It will print space how many times num minus i times that is nothing but three space it will print three space next 
here we can see the concatenation symbol so it will print star how many times i times so it will print one okay so it will print like that here no need of using any end or any print statement for the new line if i save this and run this so if i mention six here we go we, we are getting in the triangle shape but we didn't want it this shape right we, we are getting that shape because of this space okay so this two pattern has a little difference in the coding so if i remove this now this space then i'll get pattern like this if i mention that space then i'll get pattern like this okay so here we are not getting the space between the stars if you want that then here you need to mention space and then here you can mention the space now if i execute this so if i enter phi here we can see we are getting the stars in this shape so if you want in the triangle shape then you need to delete one space from here now if i save this and run this so there is a little difference between these two patterns so we are done with this and this okay so now we'll see this patterns this pattern and this pattern we'll begin with this pattern okay diamond shape i want to print characters in the diamond shape so for this what i need to do is this is the upper part of the diamond shape okay i need to copy and i need to paste here for the lower half so for that i need to take here from num to 0 minus 1 why because here we can see this is the upper part in the lower part we can see first we want four star three star two star one star like that right that's why we need to take range like this so now if i save this and run this enter the number of rows i'll enter five here we go so here we can see these two rows contain same number of uh, stars if you don't want this okay if you want to remove this then you can mention here num minus one okay then you'll get the pattern like this if you don't want that previous pattern then you can do like this if you want that extra row then you can keep this you can keep range as num to zero minus one and next if i comment this now this is for the upper part of the diamond shape right if i comment this now and if i run this now it will ask the number of rows if i enter five here we can see the next pattern we are printing stars in this shape so now this is also done now we want to print like this right so for this here i'll include another space and if i save this and run this here we can see this shape and if i remove this space okay just mention the star and i it will print this pattern okay so in this single code we can do few changes and we can get all the patterns next i'll remove this comment okay so here also i'll remove this okay so now if i execute this what will happen here we can see we are getting this shape it is the arrow shape so to make it more perfect i can include num minus one here we are getting the arrow pattern now if i include space here so if i keep space here here i'll include a space okay now if i save this and run this i'll include five here we can see this shape so drawing pattern is very easy in python using the same basic structure i can do a minor changes to this program and i i can write the stars in the different shape okay so that's it for now guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel i will meet you in next class till then take care